So that was honestly that was very unexpected. I didn't expect for them to release the first episode this today. So I was you know caught off guard by that, but you know whatever, it's whatever. Um, overall, you know after watching the first episode, I'll definitely um I'll give it you know probably a probably review it. Um, it's pretty much a flat out story, like um. It's pretty much a story about this a human um, that's in you know that was raised by a demon, and you know that kid is the the demon commander, and he hid his um, identity um, all his life, and then now um, kind of ruined it because um, we saw you know. Um, he got caught off guard by raid, so, and then we see, like, oh, it's obvious that the maid knows now, and he said that, you know, I'll keep you as my maid, so we have that, and then in the episode, he also mentioned that, we also see that there's one other demon commander, um, that actually, like, knows his secret. Like actually knows that he's a human. He's running out of the sky. So we get introduced to that character. And then we also get introduced that like. Um, he meets the Doom Lord in this episode. And um, before the Doom, as the Doom Lord left. She says that I want to see your real face next time. So um, and then after she left um, the commander said oh thankfully like even though she knew it was a mask thankfully she didn't know it was like sh you're human so there's that but um overall pretty exciting um there's a theory i came up with and i think it might be the case so in the beginning of the way this story is narrated is that in the beginning of the episode we see this young girl um, she walks down the castle, a castle, basement, library, um, well not library, room, and we see, you know, bookshelf, she takes out the bookshelves, and she starts reading, and that's how the story begins, and then we see how episode one ended when she you know, closed the book, so I assume one page was done, but from the way everything was set up um my theory is that in the future because this obviously the story telling is happening in the future so obviously in the future he becomes the team lord um i don't know maybe i'm guessing at this point in the future since he's the team lord some people in the castle already know like hey this guy's a human and then it's obvious that he had a child, a girl, with um, the maid that we see in this episode, the lady that he made, his maid. So it's obvious that he made, you know, a child with her. So she's probably a demon queen or, or whatever or something. Um, and so, yeah, it's just very obvious that that's kind of the whole setup of the story of I'm guessing that's kind of be the big reveal of like oh they actually you know got together and everything and from what I'm seeing from where um, we're like judging from his reward and how he's like I guess repairing it I'm guessing in the future like He's not gonna try and push it, but he's gonna try and make like a territory that's neutral. Like maybe a small town or city, but neutral town. So human and orc or demon can live together. Um, and you know, uh, whichever person causes problem, doesn't matter to the race, um, they will be escorted it out and I'm guessing like some kind of punishment will um, befall them but yeah 
I mean, that's just my theory, that's what I think, because it's very, like, we already seen episode 1, he was giving a territory, and we saw it in that ter territory, um, the way he, you know, he, uh, one of his, I guess, soup, not supervisors, but one of his peers said, I guess one of his servants said, you know, it will take six months to, um, repair this wall. And so he th he said no, it'll take one month because if we have the humans and demons work together, so I feel like that was a foreshadowing of like you know that territory being a neutral zone. Um. So once again, this is all just a theory, but I feel you know pretty passionate. Pretty, I think this theory is kind of right or at least on the right track but I don't know I guess we'll have to wait and see more of the episode to um you know to get a better look at you know what the overarching story is but um yeah overall I think it was a pretty cool uh, anime series definitely gonna try and watch it um looks pretty interesting to me so probably can make a review on it or at least keep up with it but um yeah thank you and i'll see you next time bye